Skin cancer is widespread and it can be deadly. But this week, local residents have a free pass to catch it early. Meteorologist Eric Zarnitz joins us live. He's on your side to tell you how. Eric? Marcia, it's quick, convenient, and it doesn't even hurt. I had my screening earlier today, and you can get yours as well. Plus, it's all free. This week, local dermatologists are offering free skin cancer screenings to promote early detection. We are happy to help the community in any way we can by offering these free screenings. We want to help people who wouldn't necessarily get them otherwise, and that's why we're here. Sarah Brown is one of the managers of the event at Wright State and helped lead me from start to finish. The first step was to put on the famous paper gown. Dr. Elizabeth Munich was kind enough to look over my skin and check for anything suspicious. After a few questions, I came out with a clean bill of health. The next part involves a dermoscan unit, which uses ultraviolet light to check out and see what normally would be invisible, like blemishes on your face. The darker marks on my face that look like freckles, that's actually skin damage, and apparently it's about pretty average for my age, 30 years old. Also, the whiter marks, that's dead skin cells, and those, of course, can be washed away. And that was it. If you're interested in getting your own free screening, there are others throughout the week. The early sessions are 9 to 11.30 a.m. and the afternoon sessions 1 to 4.30 p.m. There's no reason to be scared. It's better to know about something that may be wrong than to ignore it and hope it goes away. If you didn't catch the sites, I'll be posting them along with a number on the website to schedule an appointment. And take it from me. It's painless. The hardest part was having our photographer crack jokes while I was in a paper gown. Reporting live, Eric Zarnard's 2 News on your side.